Hey there everyone, this is Jessica from DomesticAmy.com and today I have a very special Fit Friday video for you. I'm sharing quick and easy and healthy bento box recipes that you can send your kids to school with and I guarantee you they'll love it, even the pickiest of eaters. So if you'd like to see more, then let's get started. <laughs> Welcome, my name is Jessica Flores and I'm a lifestyle blogger and vlogger at domesticatedme.com. I post about fashion, beauty, DIY projects, you name it, I cover it all at domesticatedme.com. I also share my story and tips on how I lost over 60 pounds. So health is very important for me, which is why I created this video. I've been asked for healthy food recipes for kids um, pretty much ever since I started my health series on YouTube, Fit Fridays, and so I've posted a few on Snapchat. I get questions, I get requests, so here I am finally doing a full video for you guys to see, and I am collaborating with Fit and Fresh. Fit and Fresh makes it easy to pack healthy lunches for your son or daughter thanks to the separate compartments in their bento boxes, which keep sandwiches and snacks safe from getting crushed or soggy. It comes with an insulated bag and ice packs to keep the lunch cool until lunchtime, and it's dishwasher safe, and the containers can even be microwaved. Ever since I started my Fit Friday series where I talk about health, nutrition, and fitness, and everything in between, I get asked for tips, recommendations, recipes, not only for adults who are also struggling with their weight, but for children, because health is important and we all want to keep our kids healthy and have a good, healthy life. So I partnered with Fit Friday to make this video where I'm going to show you how to create three quick and easy and healthy recipes to send your kid to school with. I promise you they will love it. Now I found that the way to get your children to eat, period, not just healthy, is to make it fun and, and exciting for them. So these recipes are not revolutionary, but they have little twists that your kids will really enjoy. So let's get started. My first meal is peanut butter and jelly. Sure, there's nothing outstanding about PB&J, but your kids will love this version made into a puzzle. All you need is one of these little gadgets and you can place it all in one piece or mix them up so your child can put it together before they eat it. I use organic dry roasted peanut butter with sea salt. When it comes to jelly, you should actually pick up jam instead because it's made with crushed fruit instead of the juice used in jelly. You can also look for organic and or low sugar options. Because the sandwich is sweet, I like to balance it out with savory snacks. In the small containers, I'm adding Horizon Organic Cheese Sticks and Annie's Cheddar Bunnies. These are also organic and don't have any artificial flavors or colors. My second meal is a turkey and cheese sandwich, but you guessed it, it's not your average turkey and cheese sandwich. I make these into animal faces using this device, which lets you create food into four different animals. Today, we're going with the panda. As you may know, turkey breasts are high in protein and low in fat. Pick your cheese or dairy-free alternative based on your child's preference or health concerns. Today I'm using this Swiss cheese slice. I'm filling these pods with carrots and nuts. Carrots are a great source of beta carotene and fiber. It's also rich in vitamin C, K, and lots of other really good things that are wonderful for developing kids. If your kids aren't into carrots, try serving them with a dip, like a healthy hummus, ranch, or even a yogurt. Speaking of yogurt, I love these GoGo -Go Squeeze yogurts. Not only are they delicious and nutritious, but you don't have to refrigerate them. Catalina happens to like carrots, so I'm filling up one of the pods with carrots and then sticking some nuts in the other pod. They're great in omega-3 fatty acids and unsaturated fasts. My last meal is a simple quesadilla. You can cut these using cookie cutters to cut them into different figures, but I'm keeping it simple and cutting them into triangles to focus on the fruit. Something Catalina loves, and as far as I know, all kids love, are fruit kebabs. I use these bamboo sticks, which bend and are not dangerous, to alternate fruits onto them. 
Today I'm filling one of the pods with strawberries and the other one with grapes, but I'm sticking these adorable little animal pigs into each fruit. Of course, you should always communicate with your school's administration to see if there are any foods that you should avoid or are not allowed to bring into the school due to allergies. So those are my three quick and easy and healthy bento box school lunches. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Please give this video a thumbs up and share if you did. And please use that comment section below to ask any questions, make any requests, just comment. I always love to hear from you guys. I will link to Fit and Fresh in the description box below as well as everything that I use, all the little gadgets and links to where you can get them in the description box below. So make sure you check that out. I also link to all of my social media. I'm on Twitter, Snapchat, Facebook, Instagram, you name it, I'm on it. Thank you again for watching. Subscribe if you're not subscribed already and stay tuned.